Hi, it's Teresa from Dodge Nature Center and time for another Nature to Go. Have you ever been out for a walk in the woods? You're enjoying the scenery, maybe noticing some wildlife. You go up to look at a plant a little closer to try to identify it and as you're reaching in to touch it, ah, all of a sudden you realize you touched another plant, a plant you try to avoid at all costs. Yeah, you just ran into stinging nettle. Nettles, also known as itchweed because that's the reaction you get when you bump into this plant. You might get little bumps on your skin, it's really, really itchy. Well, why does that happen? What is there that nettles are doing to you? Well, if you look on the underside of the leaf or the stem, there's lots of tiny little hairs. And when you bump into the plant, you break off those tips and that releases chemicals that are inside. They kind of act like little hypodermic needles poke into your skin, release those chemicals, and then your body reacts to it. A quick remedy when you're outdoors is there are two different plants that you can squish the leaves of and rub it in the area where you ran into the nettles, and it'll help stop the itching. The one is plantain. Yeah, it's that plant we walk by all the time, but the leaves actually can help stop the itching. And the other is jewel weed, which we've talked about before, and it's great for everything from poison ivy to mosquito bites, and here again for nettles. It can help stop your itching. While we don't like the itch that they give us when we bump into them, did you know nettles are actually quite delicious? But that's for another episode. Thanks for joining me for this episode of Nature to Go, and we'll talk to you again next time.